All right, I'm going to go to the phone for a second. They've been very patient, uh, so I just want to make give them an opportunity as well. Marvin Marshall with the Nighttime News Space Report. Go ahead. Hi, uh, my name is Marvin Marshall from the Nighttime News Space Report. I appreciate you guys having having us out here today. Um, now, um, my question kind of uh, banks on the camera uh, the, the camera question there. You know, I was wondering, you know, how much public engagement will there be? Does it mean the live streaming from orbit? You know, pictures are worth a thousand words, but you know that video just does so much more for us now. Will, will there be like an emphasis on providing the public with live streams after the launch live stream? Uh, you know, on orbit, uh, you know that initial live stream and. You know, like on Artemis One or even Artemis Two. And thank you for taking our questions. Thank you. Okay, I'll, I'll try to answer that. Uh, if I if I heard it correctly, and if I didn't, you can ask again when we're, when I'm finished. But um, yes, throughout the mission, we will be having live stream uh, imagery coming down. Uh, but it's in competition with all the data that we need to get down as well. Uh, we we are limited on our data rates that we'll be transmitting uh, information down from the from Orion uh, throughout the mission. Uh, there's periods where we'll go to a high day rate, uh, where we'll be able to do imagery and then also keep uh, maintain our telemetry. Uh, but uh, for a lot of these events, we'll also be uh, recording the, the high resolution imagery, and then those would be downlinked uh, after the after the event. Um, we have a, a priority list of how we're going to bring uh, files off of the off of the uh, Orion. So it's it's going to take a matter of time because there's a lot of data that we'll be bringing down on a, on a continuous basis. Uh, so it'll be after uh, somewhat after the event to get the real high res. But the intent also is to have some streaming uh, imagery throughout the uh, during these events as well. And let's go to let's go to Melissa real quick. So uh, she wants to add a little bit about what happens at the recovery phase for imagery. Go ahead, Melissa. Awesome, thank you. Yeah, so we have about 17 cameras all over the ship in helicopters in the open water. Uh, several of those are connected to a, um, a basically a satellite system that we have on board that we will be able to stream near real time live video back to Johnson to be um, sent over NASA TV. So we will, you will be able to see um, recovery operations real time. Very good. Let's also go to the phone. Last one on the phone, Marsha Dunn, Associated Press.